um, on the first poem. I'm going to read quite a lot of mini stuff today, if that's okay, but um, I thought yeah. I should also um, do a bit of old things so I can read the whole way through. Um, and so my first poem I'm going to do is, is a poem I perform a lot, and it, it kind of is looking at, broadly, um, the way that as poets we treat our material and the way that we maybe talk about things that we don't have any ownership of, or, um, yeah, what I'm going to do with the poem, and then you'll see what it's about. <laughs> it's called A Man of Mal, um, and it goes like this. I only ever had green pigs as pets, but I reckon I'd have felt pretty upset if I'd had to leave them behind in the darkness of the sky and run. A Man of Mal wanted to take her parrot with her as she left Syria and home and under the cover of the night joined thousands in their flight for something more like safety. She's a teenager, so I reckon she taught that bird more than just pretty Polly. Maybe she told it how she couldn't do her homework, how the smirk of the girl at her school, the boy she fancied, fancied bat out of whack, and I reckon she spoke to it when the bombs fell. I reckon she watched it fly and dreamt of a future as a vet may be, or as she trimmed its claws, perhaps it was hairdressing or pedicures that made her want to grow up tall. 